Hello everyone, um, this is going to be kind of a random video, but I thought it would be fun to share. So, um, I recently decided to actually watch Doctor Who for the first time. I've, ever, I've never seen it. Um, my sister is a very huge fan, and she actually owns uh, the first seven seasons, because I don't think you can buy season eight yet, or I don't know where it's at yet right now. But anyways, she basically owns everything that's available, I think. Um, so I figured I'd finally get around to watching it, because she's always wanted me to watch it, and I said, alright, I'll finally check it out. So, um, naturally, because it's not on Netflix anymore, uh, I don't know why they did that, um, I said, okay, let me just borrow your DVDs, because like I said, she owns everything. She got them, uh, she bought these new, uh, well, she didn't buy them, she got them as gifts, uh, on Christmas, uh, last year, uh, and they were new. You know, they came in the mail, everything was fine, except for these two. Season 4 and Season 6, um, which are by far the worst, poorly the most poorly designed DVDs I've ever seen in my life. Um, wait, wait till you see this. Okay. So, um, Season 4, and she pointed this out to me. I had no clue about this until yesterday um, when she handed me all the discs uh, to, you know, to borrow to watch the show. Uh, so, Season 4, nice looking packaging on the outside, you know. Not, nothing wrong here. BBC video. Um, they're responsible for what's going to happen next. So, you open it up. Okay, everything's fine still. Nice little artwork. And you open it up. And get ready for this. Ready? I'm not even kidding. That is how it came in the mail. By brand new. In the plastic. And look at this. Yeah. <laughs> Are you kidding me? How do you come up? How how do you how do you mess up that badly? Like how? And I know it's these these two seasons only because there's something else I have to show you. Wait, wait till you see the discs. The discs are even worse. Um, how how do you do this? I mean, seriously, they didn't even put any effort into gluing these on. And look, some of these are broken. There's no clips. This one has the clip still here, but look, this one has no clip. It broke off. It was broken off already. And the glue is like rock solid. It's like the glue, you know, it dried up before it could attach itself to, to the artwork. So these are not glued on, and the discs were on this, and they all fell out. I mean, we have, the discs are okay, but, you know, once you first open this, you can imagine the shock um, to seeing a brand new set fall apart so easily. Uh, wow, I mean, geez, I've never owned a DVD that, that terrible, like, you know, that poorly made, in terms of packaging. Um, now, in my opinion, this one's worse. So, season six, you figure, you know, two years later, they'd, uh, learn their lesson, because season five looked okay. The other seasons that she has, they, they're all okay. I mean, these two are just, ugh. So, okay, season six, now, like I said, outside looks okay, looks nice. And then you get to the inside. All right, BBC video, what'd you do to this this time? Okay, get ready for this. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's like a book, cool. All right, so, seriously, there is literally no glue on the spine. There is no glue. You know how this works? Look at this, it's coming apart. These are detaching from each other. This was supposed to be glued onto the spine of the artwork. But guess what? I do not see any glue whatsoever. I'm not even joking. I don't see any evidence of glue ever being used. So, BBC Video, um, y'all suck. <laughs> I mean, wow. Jeez. Just, uh Now, um, I mentioned that the discs are worse. So, what I decided to do, you know, because I'm going to be watching the show, um, I don't know how long it's going to take me, but it's going to take a while. I said, alright, just hand me all the discs, I'll just borrow them, I'll put them in, you know, a nice case like this so it's a little easier, and plus all those boxes suck anyway. Um, so, I'm going to get to Season 4 and Season 6. Now, take a look at this. Do you think they could have placed that hole anywhere else? Look where it's placed. I'm not even kidding, look, I didn't make that up. They placed the hole in the uh, crotch region of that robot. Look, look at this one. I mean, it's a little, you know, it's a little better, but still, look. Is there any other ones? No, okay. 
Now, wait till you see this. Okay. Which one is it? Uh, oh, here it is. Okay. So, let's take a look real quick at some of the episode names. Okay. The Fires on... The Fires of Pompeii. I'm sure everyone's heard of Pompeii and how you spell it. P-O-M-P-E-I-E. -E, or E-I-I. -I. Okay, what's another one? Uh, Planet of the Ood. O-O-D. That's apparently something from the show. My sister told me. Um, I thought that was like a typo for odd, but it's not really. Anyways, um, I know there's another one. Where is it? Uh, which one is it? There's another one. Uh... Planet. Okay, you'll see it. So, let's take a look at those. THR. THR. Santeron. Stra Stratagem. What? What? What does that even say? You know what it's supposed to say? The Santerian Stratagem. THR. They didn't know how to spell the. Santaron. There's supposed to be an I after the R. Okay, well, let me... Okay, I can, I can, you know, understand. That's not a real word in English, I guess. But the? How do you misspell the? Now get ready for this one. Um, it's not on this disc. Which one is it on? It's on... Oh, here it is. Okay. It's on this one. Planet of... The T-D... No, no, no. T H D E Ood. Planet of. They misspelled the again. How? They misspelled planet. Plam it. Seriously? The Fireds of Pompel. Bruh. <laughs> Fireds? Oh my god. Seriously. Look. The Fires of Pompeii. The Fireds of Pompel. Um, okay, so, um, <laughs> now we looked at the other, uh, seasons, um, it seems like these two seasons are the only ones that are just, you know, bad, like, poorly made, typoed, everything, um, I don't think the season six discs, though, have any typos on them, but season four, the packaging and the discs suck, season six, just the packaging sucks, but... Wow. I mean, how do you misspell the <laughs> twice? How do you misspell planet? Like, come on, seriously? And you put fires instead of fires? So, uh, I don't know. Um, so, what I'm trying to say is, don't buy these DVD sets. <laughs> if you want to watch Doctor Who, find a different way to do it, because, uh, uh or at least season four and six, because these are, oh, poorly made. The other ones were okay, like I said. I should have brought them out to show you, but... Yeah, uh, jeez, man, it's kind of, I guess you could call that a rant on Doctor Who DVDs, but, uh, so what I'm gonna have to do, she said she wanted to throw these out, I said no, because, you know, I'm a collector, I don't want to see anybody throw anything out like that, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have to glue it myself and try to fix it. <sighs> jeez, but, you know, something I can't fix is those typos, but whatever. So, I hope you enjoyed this, um... Don't buy these DVDs. That's all I'm going to say. At least for these seasons. Yeah, just what a fail. Uh, BBC Video. Well, it doesn't even say BBC Video right there. It's like they decided later on not to even show, themse show themselves anymore. Here we go, season two. BBC Video. You guys. Boo. So, anyways, I'm looking forward to watching Doctor Who, anyways. Uh, let me know, you know, what you guys think of it. Uh, I can't wait to start watching it. I'm gonna start from uh, the 2005 uh, first season that they did. You know, the revival, not the old, the old uh, Doctor Who stuff from like the 60s. My sister actually has never even seen that stuff, but uh, I don't even know if you can buy it. But you know, hopefully one day if they do release it on DVD, if it hasn't been already, they put a little more effort into the sets, unlike this one. So that's that. All right, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed that and. Uh, yeah, you know, spell check, it's a, it's, a, it's a good thing. Use it. Especially if you're ma making mainstream products, you should spell check something before you release it. 
I don't know, just a little bit of advice. Okay, <laughs> have a good one, guys.